Amy Roback and TJ Holmes, who were fired from Good Morning America over their off-camera romance, released the second episode of their new podcast, and they wanted to clear the air over comments they made about Roback's friend Sarah Haynes. In the December 12th episode, Roback clarified that the couple were just joking in the Amy and TJ premiere when they said they were afraid Haynes, co-host of ABC's The View, would lose her job because of her association with the couple. We joked, we hope she doesn't get fired, Roback said. We just wanted to make it clear, Sarah Haynes did not get fired from The View. It is funny how people pick up those things and make something out of it. Holmes, for his part, called out media mogul Byron Allen as providing constant conversation, offering advice and support to him through the ordeal. In the December 5th episode, Roback had named Haynes as one of the people who provided continual support and check-ins after she and Holmes were suspended by ABC News. Holmes had joked, they're probably going to fire her after this airs, to which Roback responded with a laugh, I know, that's why I was afraid. I think it's positive, but maybe it won't be positive for her. On the latest segment of the podcast, Roback and Holmes did not directly address a report last week by the New York Post's page 6 that their former spouses, Andrew Shu and Marilee Feebig, had been dating for about six months after bonding over the traumatic experience of being cheated on. Holmes referred to headlines in the past week with agendas. And we absolutely anticipated that that was going to happen. Nothing we can do about those. He continued, but this place, this podcast, this platform, is not and will never be about gossip. This is not going to be a place where we clap back at headlines. We are not going to get into those back and forth games, because gossip is toxic. Earlier in the episode, Holmes responded to reports that he was handsy with Roback on the red carpet at iHeartRadio's Jingle Ball in New York last Friday. Look, it's a bad habit, I suppose, it could be sweet, but it could be sexualized or viewed as such, Holmes said. But I have a bad habit of, when I put my arm around you, my hand ends up lower than your waist. And I'm trying to break the habit. Meanwhile, Roback and Holmes denied a report they were dirty dancing at a wedding the following day. I literally did not dance a single song that night, because it was yacht rock, Holmes said. In the premiere of Roback and Holmes' podcast, produced with and distributed by iHeartMedia, they spoke out publicly for the first time about their dismissal from GMA. The best way to sum us up, Amy and TJ, is that we're the folks who lost the jobs we love because we love each other, Holmes said on the premiere episode. In late November 2022, Holmes and Roback said, when news broke about their relationship, they had already initiated divorce proceedings with their respective spouses. We were outed as being in a relationship, Holmes said on the podcast. But everyone else thought we were being outed as adulterers, being outed as cheating on our spouses, which wasn't the case. 